I hate to buy all this, right? I'm saying that I have to buy it. Right. Basically, or right. it will be an enforcement made against me. Blah, sure. blah, blah. I.e., confiscate my car or that. I don't need a teller license. Right. You know what I tell you? It's irrelevant if I've got a teller, I don't need a license. Right. Reason being, it's a scam with BBC. Right. Uh, you don't need a teller license. It's not enforceable. And it isn't enforceable, so I'm basically being threatened by. Like, I read that this morning, and obviously, I've been behaving myself for a long time now, so Aye. I was like, fine, no chance. So I've read in, I've read in, and I've looked up on it, and basically, it's a scam with the BBC to get money out of people who's got well enough to pay it. Yeah. Right? But it's beyond that now, because it's like, that's the POAS. That's, yeah, it's, court, it's, it's, it's that's court, right, but that's a system that I don't stand under. Or, right. what you need to do, I've got a telephone number, I'll write down. Do you see where I'm coming from with that? Well, unfortunately... Because, see, these statute snacks, I don't stand under any of them. Right, well, they're written into the law, so they're... They're not written no, no. the law. They're, they're, they're not. They're not. They're, they're not. They're not. They're in the law. You feel me? Aye, aye. aye. The thing is, it's just for my benefit, with that's, that's but that's right. But that isn't the law. Statutory acts are under the law, which are, which are brought in by cops, which is the Crown Office... And that's the a maritime law. law. That's maritime law. That's sea law. No. Of course it is. Of course not. It's common law. It's no. Act. Act. And the Which act is, is just... Act this is, is the problem. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Well, that isn't the law. Tell you what I'll do, Mark. I'll explain how the law works, right? How you do you think the law works? How the law works? No, that isn't how it works. It's not how it works. It's how you make it work. Right, but tell me anyway. No, no, tell no, me. No, I, I, need to, I need to hear this, eh? Because well, obviously I've got problems here, so I need to hear what you would say. What it is, is we have... Common law, okay. Mm. The common law is backed up with statutes laws, statutes, right. which go through local government right. and government. Uh -huh. Okay. I've got to consent to them, though. No, you don't. I do. I do. I do. Oh, I'm telling you, I do. I've got to consent to them. If you, if you believe that, that, then that's up to you. I do. We have a thing called the tripartite system. Right. Okay. And then they're brought in as enforcement. Okay. And statute laws by. By, by the governing bodies. So okay. they change the rules to make them suit. So, that way tell me. Different statutes in Scotland, as there is in England, right. governed by the Crown Office and Prosecution Services, right. okay, and the Property Fiscal System. Right. Okay. In relation to a TV licence, if they deem that it's legal for you to have a TV licence if you've got a TV. Okay. I've, I've got five TVs, but I don't know what's telling them. I play consoles on them. Well. But I shouldn't be getting threatened. You right. well, I want to, this is another approach, right. and I want to get them done for harassment. Well, you need to speak to the Crown Office through the court. Through the PF, basically. Right. If you speak to the fines officer, in which they come for it, because basically what happens is you get a £75 fine, which is in ways of a means of inquiry, right, yeah. uh, if it comes to that, which comes from the court. So you need to get in, uh, in contact with the fines officer. Right. See, because speak to the basically the Bill of Rights, which is the most important document that's ever existed right. in Britain's history, tells you, clearly states that any promise or threat you fine before actually being found guilty as illegal and void. Right. And that's obviously a law that stands for. And because the tele licence threaten you before anything, it's technically See my point is I'm thinking I'm doing the right thing coming around and seeing yourself simply uh -huh. because at least you hey Ken, could you note that I've been here? For what purpose? For to uh, put a complaint on if, if you're not going to do it for but I wouldn't take your complaint it'd be uh, why not? It would be the But you're a police man, that's what your job is. No it's not. How's it not? I I do I'm not meaning be a, I'm not meaning be my secretary. I'm just taking well, a note that I've been here to, to say about this because I'm being harassed today. I deal matters of the law. What but you need to do with it is deal, you, you deal with the court issuing. Okay. Right, so we, we report the circumstances or agencies report the circumstances to the, to the law office. Okay. Right. The law office then issue out. I mean, because basically they, they've they've come with us now. This is mere threatening in the last letter. Well, there's an address on there. The sheriff court. Ah, it'll be the. Ah, it will be. But, uh, the he, point, the point is, they've no, see, they've no threatened me, but they're going to take my car. I don't need your car. If you, if you didn't get any joy with them, you're well within your rights to go to the, the, the human rights law, oh, etc. Right. And the European Court of Human Rights. Aye, the European Court of Human Rights. I cannot you need, do that. You need to do that in the middle of it. I mean, because that, this is all, all basically that's happened is they've got my signature, right, right TV license, before I was obviously knew what the, the rigmarole is. Right. That's just to create joinder to get me on this birth certificate 
to, to tie my name to that birth certificate. That birth certificate, is no, that's just a bit of paper, that's no mine. It is my name on it, but it's no recording. Well, sure, I, will, I will advise you, okay, that I'm an on duty police officer. Mm -hmm. Okay, Aye. so that can't go anywhere than your phone. What's that? That but, can't go anywhere other than on your phone. But do you mean? How do you, so how do you get that? If that's way on any network or site, then I'll be doing you under the Telecom Communications Act. What law is that? Act 2003. And what does that? That's what they're trying to do with okay. that. Telecom Communications That's just ridiculous, Paul. That's, that's, I only submit to common law, mate. I, what is common law? common law? What is the fact that is in common law? I've got common you're, law. A, you're a public servant, mate. Uh -huh. You're working for me. I'm in my rights to be video on this. To protect him. You're, you're working for public. That's correct. Public. That's, public. Public. That's correct. Public. That's correct. I'm trying to offer you advice. That's correct. Oh, I, I'm taking okay. it. But you're, not, you're trying to, you're offering me the wrong advice, mate, because I follow common law. I didn't consent nor understand to any laws or your maritime law that you use what I apply. Maritime laws are Exactly. You didn't cane me. That's what we're saying to you. Look it up. There's a difference. Okay, guys. Cheers.